Welcome to the new Battle Pass, Fury Outbreak. Let's begin with this season's highlights. Among the familiar rewards, there will also be a special currency, Vault Coins. You'll be able to spend it in the Battle Pass Vault to purchase the most valuable rewards of previous seasons, like vehicles, weapons, and unique customization pieces. We'll make a separate video about the Vault very soon. So for now, let's meet the main rewards of the new season. The main prize of the VIP part is a Russian multi-role super maneuverable TVC strike fighter, the SU-35S Flanker E. Its design inherited the family traits, but its performance is way ahead of its predecessors. This air superiority fighter has the cutting edge R-77ME air-to-air missiles, with active homing devices and the highest damage among in-game missiles of this class. For surface targets, it also has some high-precision, long-range 3M-14AE missiles. Thanks to their precision and durability, enemy anti-air defenses will be a breeze. For short ranges, the X-38 air-to-surface missiles will come in handy. With their high reload rate, you can launch your entire stock in a short time. In addition to precision munitions, this aircraft can also use large-caliber unguided rockets, the simple and reliable S-25 OFF. And of course, there's always a built-in 30mm autocannon, just in case. Here's another exciting award of the VIP Battle Pass, a new generation strike drone, the Pan Spatial Spiderwing. This UAV has vertical takeoff and landing capabilities, while its improved aerodynamics provide it with excellent speed and outstanding maneuverability. The ability to hover significantly enriches its tactical capabilities. Up close, this drone can hit surface and aerial targets with its 100 kilowatt aircraft lasers. For longer ranges, it has the hypersonic SWHG missiles that can achieve top speed in almost no time and deliver massive damage to any surface target they hit. At close and medium ranges, there's the AGM-176 Griffin B lightweight multi-role missiles launched in volleys of eight. They have a high chance of suppressing enemy air defenses and completing their mission successfully. Another explosive reward of the VIP Battle Pass is the naval version of the solid fuel multiple warhead missile, the MGM-140 Antikams. Excellent launch range and velocity make it efficient at any distance. Soon after launch, this missile quickly gains altitude, which allows it to be launched from behind low obstacles, and when it gets to its target, it splits into submunitions, each of which deals damage. The Premium Battle Pass will bring you an improved version of the American anti-submarine grenade launcher, the RUR-5C ASROC. With an extra four cells, it can fire a total of 12 projectiles, and their velocity has been improved as well. The delay between shots has also been reduced thanks to each volley now containing six projectiles. All these improvements don't just make the launcher a terrific weapon against ships and subs, they make it an efficient tool against incoming torpedoes, too. The free part of the Battle Pass gives our players the HMS Glasgow Type 26 Frigate, City Class. In real life, this vessel is currently being built for the United Kingdom's Royal Navy and is planned to enter service in 2026. Glasgow's main tasks include anti-sub warfare, air defense, and general purpose operations. The frigate can carry unique medium-range jam-resistant missiles, the RGM-84 Harpoon Block II. With a volley of four, a quick reload, and immunity against flares, they're a truly dangerous weapon. The warship also has the new Mark IIe long-range anti-ship missiles, the built-in 155mm Mark VIII Mod II cannon with excellent accuracy, range, and velocity, as well as the 533mm Spearfish heavy torpedoes. Various air defense systems placed all around the ship protect it against airborne threats. The Bofors Mark IV autocannons and Hell's lasers deflect air raids, while C-RAM and Aster 30 systems intercept missiles. This frigate is also protected by the RAH-66 Comanche attack helicopter. 
The free part of the Battle Pass also has an advanced AA weapon from South Korea. This rapid-firing 30mm Gatling autocannon is called the CIWS-2. It sets a new in-game record for air defense range, while also having one of the best total damage per minute rates. And of course, what's a battle pass without unique customization? The VIP part gives our players the legendary late fall camo. This season knows how to leave tastefully. The camo preserves its passing patterns for the owner, highlighting them with captivating visual effects. The premium part of the BP gives you an epic camo and two epic avatars. Theatrical duality reminds the viewers that each story has at least two sides. And what's a richer or clearer way to convey this than theater? Make yourselves comfortable and enjoy the show. Trent Howley is an epic avatar looking at you with the eyes of a spec ops head whose department is a secret government program. He's a scientist, a researcher, and a pioneer. He uses experimental techniques to develop new, safer ways to complete missions. His group brings valuable results, often in coordination with other special units. Here's the other epic avatar, Dmitry Beryozov. He's a talented engineer who comes from a family of aircraft designers. His career was doing great, but he was always looking for something more daring. So he completed a special program and got a job in a department where he worked on experimental prototypes. The free part of the battle pass contains the rare Vicious Game camo. Sometimes you gotta do radical stuff to survive. It's easy to give in to the darkness, but guiding light, or perhaps a tune, can save you from this fate. You were chosen to be part of this vicious game where your very existence is at stake. Will you emerge victorious? Another free reward is the rare avatar of Randall Wiley, king of the galley and a simply remarkable lad. He spent more than 20 years working the kitchen. With his passion and duty, he came a long way from a simple cook to the esteemed culinary specialist. Make sure you try his stew, unless you make the mistake of crossing him in the past. In addition to the Battle Pass, there's also the Eclipse Falcon Bundle, available for purchase for art coins between the 3rd and the 5th of November. It brings the Chinese H-18 Stealth Bomber to the game, which you'll also be able to trade in the market. This proposed aircraft is meant for suppressing enemy air defenses at ultra-low altitudes and delivering precision strikes. The bomber's arsenal includes the following cutting-edge weaponry for this. The Wave Rider, a bleeding-edge super-fast air-to-surface missile. The YJ-21, a hypersonic missile with an aircraft launch capability. A supersonic long-range cruise missile, the CM-400 AKG. A heavy subsonic anti-ship cruise missile, the YJ-83KH. And a stealth glide bomb, the GB-6B. That's it for today. Play Modern Warships, try the new weaponry, pick your favorite camos or avatars, and see you at sea.